Hello everyone, it's a Hopeful Bubble here and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Better on Bedrock. Oh boy, we've got a big day today because I have been spending some time AFKing here and working on this farm that we built in the last episode. And look what we've got so far. We've got a trident. Oh yeah, we've got a trident. <laughs> um... <clears throat> and we also have got some gunpowder, which I'm going to take back home. And I've also been spending some time getting some cobblestone here since, I mean, we might as well. But let's head back home and go back to sleep. So in day 23, I really want 123, not 23, 123. <laughs> I really want to build up some bridges because it is getting exhausting just walking across all these areas. So I'm thinking we make a main bridge over in this direction and then a main bridge over in this direction as well. And then possibly maybe this one, even though we've got this lily path bridge. So maybe not this one, but... I for sure want to make these two bridges in this in those two directions since I mean they're a pain in the butt to get across. Um, for our block palette, I am thinking a wood standard bridge with um, I want to say spruce, but we are kind of running out of spruce. So let's do dark oak and oak. Take lots of oak, and then. Um, I was gonna do andesite, but we're kind of out of andesite, so maybe just wood, maybe just standard wood is gonna have to work. Yeah, that's gonna have to work. I swear, these guys are literally everywhere. I cannot get rid of them. I don't know if it's a bug or what it is. But now I have to go over there and kill him and get the effect and start a raid. So, yay. I cannot believe I have to do this again. Alrighty, so here we have bridge number one that leads to our portal. I really like this bridge just because it looks so simple and unique. And I forgot to put lanterns right here. But don't worry. I'll go ahead and replace those. And then we've got some lanterns just all over. For the other bridge, I did something a little different. Um, made an overhang bridge. Just since it was super long and I wasn't able to connect it very well, I just went ahead and did like an overhang. Which I think looks super cute and very whimsical. I went ahead and lit up everything over here. Chopped down a few trees. Looks like this one still needs to be chopped down. Um, just lit everything up since it was just super dark over here. And I do have some future plans to build over here. So, I think that'll look really cute. What do you guys think? I think it'll look great. Alright, so now that we've got that off our list... I think that we should accomplish one of the chart, not charts, the um, ideas that were on our board, and it is going to be a path. Oh wait, didn't we technically do mob farm? Okay, so then that one's just going to be blank now. Um, let's work on some paths. Oh my gosh.
my goodness, our little island is starting to come together. It is so cute. Let's take a look. I just have this little hydrangea little patch. And then as you guys saw, the flower cluster patch. I actually have two of those since I love the look of them. I've got these little stone pebbles just kind of scattered around. Have some paths just going everywhere. I forgot what the name of this is, of the iris. Um, but I love the way that they look. I went ahead and um, closed out these blazing star flower patch. And I did the same thing with our lavender little patch right here. And then added some foxgloves, some um, more red clusters. And oh my goodness, I think that this is looking super good so far. I love the way that this looks. Now the next part that I really want to work on is a living room. Since I think that would look super cool. Now, is there a TV in this add-on? No, there's not. So, we're going to have to make some paintings. Let's make just one for right now. And then we'll make a sofa. We'll make two. And then we'll have a armchair, which I think would look really good. And then, what else can we add? into a living room. Ooh, we're gonna need some tables. Hmm, which table looks the best for the living room? Maybe the dark oak ones? But I feel like that would be too dark. How about some oak ones? Yeah, let's go with the oak. Let's just do it. Okay. Let's do four maybe and then grab two of these and then let's just see what else we can make some hanging signs Ooh, a pet bed maybe a standing lamp hmm oh these wooden paths are cute too Ooh, an empty mug that would be super adorable on that's expensive for a little mug a little mug that's kind of expensive what else can we make a creeper plushie wait that's adorable wait are we able to dye this even though I already can I turn this into dye no I cannot how about the pink petals. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. I feel like the white would look better anyways. Since I'm just super picky on how everything looks. Okay. Let's run upstairs and place these real quick since I think that these would look super cute up here. Wait, I want to see this mug that's like super expensive to make. Wait, that's so cute! I hate that it's super expensive, but it is adorable. Also, I don't like the way that this apple sits. Can we put it right there? Yeah. Just because I don't like the way that it's technically a block. And so it interacts with the glass. Okay. Now for this room. Do we even want to put a painting in here? Hmm. I just want something small. I think I might have to place this wood. Pinocchio. Let's see how that looks. Okay. And then let's get out this. So I'm thinking we should do... A sofa here. Oh, 
Let's put the sofa here. And then the sofa here. And then how about one sofa right there? And then maybe we should make another one. Where's this armchairs? They're there. Well, guess I made two. Okay. One right here. And then maybe we'll just stick one right there. Cute. And then let's go ahead and place these tables. I think one would be perfect right there, here, and maybe here. How's that look so far? A little crowded, I'm not gonna lie. I think it's because of the amount of armchairs I placed in here. So let's see if we can get rid of this one. And if that helps or not. Okay, I do think that, that kind of helps with the clutter look. Maybe we should put the armchairs on this back wall. Maybe that'll look better. Let's give it a try. Just because I want it to look like a sitting area instead of like a awkward little living room. How about that? Maybe move Sofa over one? See, I just feel like... Hmm. Oh my goodness! Our house better not be on fire! Let's go to sleep real quick. Okay, now that our house is not being struck by lightning, I think that this looks a lot better. Let's go with this, and then let's just obviously put some plants down, since that is going to look the best. Um, ooh, I know we can make hanging flower pots. Hanging flower pots. So, we need a flower pot, dirt, and some sticks. That sounds easy enough. Let's grab some dirt. And then we've got some sticks and some flower pots in here. Okay. Oh, wow. We can make a lot. Let's just make four for right now. And then let's put... <gasps> Yellow cluster would look so cute. Let's take a look. How about here? Oh, no. Let's get rid of that. It doesn't give us a bag. Hello? Okay, can't put the flower cluster in there. How about a rose bush? Can you put a rose bush in there? It's a better on bedrock item, which I did not know that. So you cannot place that one in there. Let's give a try to... Let's try the better on bedrock stuff. Let's try the violets, the lav... Actually, I don't think the lavender is going to work. Um, What else is from better on bedrock? Fox gloves are not better on bedrock. I forgot that we have these daisy petals, but I don't think they're gonna work. Let's try the tiny sprout and then. What about in here? Anything? Ooh, we could try the cherry sapling. That might look pretty good. Okay, let's try the violet first. Okay, violets do not work. 
What about the tiny no. sprout? The lilacs? No? Okay, what about the sapling? Okay. So I, th I guess they're just pure decoration. Which is fine, I guess. Okay. Well, I know that the other pods work with the um, X the furniture mod, so why don't we grab those? Ooh, I think the lined ones look way better in my opinion. Okay. For sure. Ooh. No. Oh, wait. We can hang these? <gasps> okay. These are way better than the Better on Bedrock ones. No offense to the mod creator, but... You actually cannot place, like, put anything in them. So let's put rose bushes. <gasps> Stop it. That is adorable. Okay. Oh, wait. We can't put the. Oh, it's literally just called a hanging pot. That makes a lot more sense why I couldn't place it. Okay. Um. Yeah, that makes a lot more sense now. Let's just type in pot. A weave pot. Dotted pot. I just want the normal pot. Line pot. Okay, so we need some bricks, string, and dirt. Bricks, string, and dirt. So we just need bricks and dirt. Or bricks and string, my bad. So we got some string. Now, where did I put all my bricks at? That's going to be the hardest part. Just trying to figure out where I put them at. Um, I don't remember, actually. Do I have bricks? I thought I did. Okay. Well, let's go and grab some bricks. Or go and grab some clay and then make... Oh, wait. Do I have anything that's smelted? No. Let's go get some clay. And then we should be good. Now, I thought I saw some clay down here. I was right. Just grab some of this. Look, you can see our, our house from in here. From the water, at least. Which I think is kind of funny. Oh, crap. I forgot that you can drown. Oopsies. Totally forgot that drowning was a real thing in this game. Okay. Oh, my grapes are... I did put some grapes here, too. Just because I thought it would be a good source of food. And because I love grapes. Grapes in real life. Listen, if you guys haven't tried frozen grapes, you guys are missing out. Put some fr uh, grapes in the in the oven not in the oven <laughs> put some grapes in the freezer not the oven <laughs> and it just hits the spot i highly recommend it you guys should totally try it okay so i think for the next part of decorating this we're gonna need some more flowers for sure Oh, wait, the books look so cute. Oh, I wish that I could, like, read and love reading in real life. I, I wish I did. I just, I can't. It is, like, way too much for me. It's hard to read for me. Since I have ADHD and because I have dyslexia, as I feel like I always mention in my videos. 
but yeah, it, it does. Str I do struggle a lot with reading for that reason. It's just like the comprehension aspect of reading. I'm just like, what am I reading? But okay, so I'm trying to think of where I can find, or even if there is a flower biome in this world. Not sure we might have to go flying around and find a flower forest but let's grab a waystone of course I'll just bring two since I always find cool stuff or I guess I need three and then let's make some more rockets since we're going to need some more of course and I think we should be good now. Got 58. We can always make more on the way. Which, that's usually what I end up having to do anyways. Alright. Should I take a shulker box with me? Or an ender chest? Let's take an ender chest, just in case. Just in case. Guys, look what I have discovered. Is it called a flencher? It's something like that, but I went ahead and placed a waystone so that we can go home and take a look. But, gosh, it's so loud. Grab some apples, golden apples, so that we can fight the flet flencher. I think it's called the flincher. But we are going to need another totem, of course. And then Oh my goodness, there's my bricks. Are you kidding me? Wow. Fine. Fine. Let's go back. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I was literally sitting there looking for those bricks forever, and I was just like, you know what, they're not here. They're not here. And I just accepted that fate. <sighs> okay. Let's go to sleep real quick, and then we will go fight this boss. There's actually two bosses over there. Ooh, there's a creeper. Charge! Okay. Let's not waste my rockets and let's just walk over there. Let's not be lazy. We won't be lazy. This one just automatically spawns. So... Oh, I'm nervous. There he is. Flender. Okay, let's eat real quick. <gasps> Holy crap! Oh my gosh, wait, this is easy. Hold on. I thought that this guy would be way more- Oh crap! I, uh... I take that back! I take that back! I take that back! I have half a heart! I have half a heart! I have half a heart! Oh god. Go away, go away, super bird, super bird, go away. I don't like you. I don't like you. Go away. Stupid tiny bird. <gasps> go, go. Underwater. Holy crap. Oh my gosh. Regen. Regen. Quickly. Quickly. Where is he? Oh my gosh. Wait. Can I reach you? Oh. We did it. Alright. Let's go see what we got from the loot. This better be good. Cause that was way too freaking stressful. <sighs> I 
You know what? It could have been worse. It could have been worse. Do I want to fight this guy? Ow. Do I want to fight this guy? No. That was stressful enough. I wonder if there's anything at the top, though. Sheep. There's sheep up here. That's all we got from the freaking flunder. I guess he was easy enough, though. Okay, so I wanted to show you guys something real quick. I did notice a bit of a bug with the... Um, I don't know if it's with the mod or if it's with the game. But I did notice a bug. Basically, I'm not able to break... Oh, wait, we have to go over there because I think that's a underground um, boss. But I am noticing a bit of a bug. So you see how these are Minecraft, right? Okay, well, it works on the yellow flowers, but let me show you what happens with the other flowers. So, yeah, see how I, when I break these, they're not dropping anything? That is the next bug that I have been noticing. Except for the dandelions. Oh, Mooblum. What happens if you kill one of these? Oh, it just makes you feel like a bad person. Oh, a buttercup flower. That's cute. Now I feel bad, though. <laughs> but um, back with the glitch. So what I've been doing to combat this is I have just been um, giving myself the flowers that I break. Obviously still breaking them and counting how many I break. But just giving myself the the amount that I have broken. But then there's also this house over here. So let me go ahead and take a look to see what's in there. Um, so that's what I've been doing to combat this broken... Not broken, but this issue. Ooh, diamond. But yeah, I just wanted to keep you guys updated and like what I've been doing. Alrighty, y'all. You guys have to see what I found. So, not only did I find this village, but this is like boss village because there is a enchanter guess guy over there. There is a what's it called? Um, little pillar guy. Ow! Somewhere over there, or actually, it's probably on the other side. We got a ruined nether portal. A little bounty thing over there. But then you guys are probably wondering, Bubbles, what is this? This is an underground um, fighting catacomb. And this is what we're going to do now. Which makes me kind of nervous because this is... This is nerve-wracking. Okay. So, I am going to grab... Some golden apples. More golden apples. And then the rest of our golden apples, our totem. And we're going to place our inner chest and grab some book bags. Do you guys call it backpacks or book bags? This is a serious debate now. So I'm going to leave these up here. I set my spawn point in one of those little houses. Actually, I brought a bed. So I might as well just set it right here. And let's go ahead and go down there. I am so nervous. Whew. Okay. We got this. We got this. Okay, we just gotta light it up. Oh, this is a larger one that I've seen. Oh, I didn't know that. What's in the cauldron? I don't know. Okay. Let's start with this one first. We've got to come back for these mob heads. Oh, boy. Oh, gosh. 
gosh, oh gosh. Okay. Light these up. And then actually we could make this a very OP little farm. Oh my goodness. We're gonna come back for that one. Okay. What's the spawner? <gasps> Wither skeletons? Seriously. This is pretty OP. Anything good? Oh, yeah. We're definitely taking these. Anything in here? Magma creams, rabbit's foot. Definitely take that. I don't think we really need the puffer fish. I think that's a health potion. Let's take that. Night vision, okay. Night vision, strength. Oh boy, okay. So we are already getting started here. Come on, there we go. Let's just put these in here. Not those, because I definitely need those. And I definitely need those, of course. Let's just take those. <coughs> Bless me! Oh my gosh. Okay. And then check the chest that's in here. And the only reason why I'm taking these harming potions is because they, um, I can make them splash potions if I wanted to. And these skulls are super cool. Might as well grab them. Okay. What's in this one? Oh, we might as well. Yeah, we might as well just take that one out. Okay. Fire buckets, or buckets of lava, I mean. Um, I'll take the arrow. Take the skull, of course. And then... Ooh, glowstone! Take that for sure. And then what's in this chest? More charcoal. Do I really want to fill up a whole backpack with lava buckets? Ooh, okay. We've got some good stuff in there. Need that, of course. Let's grab all this iron and gold. I don't need those books just because I already have so many of those. We might have to set a waystone here. Oh gosh. Okay. A witch farm. Actually, that might be a good gunpowder farm now that I'm thinking about it. Because if you think about it. Ooh, an uncommon loot bag. Or a common loot bag. I mean, it's not the worst. What's in here? Coal. Okay, so skeletons. This is the largest one of these dungeons that I've ever found. Like, ever found. Like, every modded world that I have tried to see if this world is going to work or the mod pack would work, I have never found a larger one like this. This is really cool. 
I'd be very interested to see if there was a creeper, a creeper farm. I think this is empty. I think I just wasted one of my rockets. Okay, now we're gonna go this way. Holy crap. that those can fit into that small little hole. Slide those up. Is there gonna be anything in these? Nothing, really. Cool. Take the anvil, of course. Okay. Now that we've cleared this end, let's go down. Did we clear this hallway? Yes, we did. Okay, let's go through the main entrance. Okay. Let's go down this way. Gunpowder. Okay. Wither skeletons. I'm not gonna get those. Just gonna grab the glowstone dust. And then I'm not gonna worry about those potions. Okay, this one's next. Ooh, I'm nervous. Actually, I shouldn't be nervous. We got this. Holy crap, the little baby is fast! Hey dang, he's got a little shovel pointing at me. everything in here diamonds of course Let's just grab everything in here might as well we can fortune it oh okay more ores I wonder if it was a glitch that there was nothing in those other chests then Ooh, a diamond. Pretty good, pretty good. Okay. Wow, okay. We got a lot of stuff. Can't forget about. What in the world? Let's see. Jesus. There's yellow wool. I've never seen that. Okay. So we've got that exit cleared. cleared. Let's clear this inventory again. 
Ooh, gotta keep that another right pickaxe. Keep that. Alright, let's eat a golden apple. And do this. Holy crap. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. Get the skeleton. Got the skeleton. Spider, 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 spider. Okay. And there's a spawner down there. Can I access those? Nothing good. Jesus. Okay. I didn't even mean to eat that apple. I was just doing it because I was scared. <laughs> okay. Get some of this ore because it prevents us from going mining, which I'm okay with. Take some of these and these. Anything in here? Yep. Don't need this stuff. Actually, don't need this stuff either. Okay, I'm just gonna leave that. And then, what about? <gasps> Ooh. Okay. grab the anvil of course listen I grab all the anvils because it is so expensive to make anvils okay I'm sorry but I've I have to it's a creature of habit I am a creature of habit okay I, I apologize if you guys are bothered I just I don't know maybe it's a good thing maybe you guys aren't bothered at all but I just wanted to make a disclaimer that I always grab the anvils and I think you should do <laughs> I think you should too, because it is beneficial from having to go mining so much for iron. Okay, and we've got another. Let's double check these. Ooh, blast protection. Nothing, nothing, nothing. There was nothing in those. here that's not terrible oh obviously take the gunpowder Make sure to light this up too, just in case. Ah. Jesus. Ah. Ouch. Holy crap, this place is huge. Okay. Jesus. 
Okay. Ah! Run! Oh god. Oh, okay, it's just a zombie. Just take care of the zombie. We're good, we're good. I hear a baby zombie. I am not happy about that. I am not happy about the baby zombie. Oh, and I'm not happy about the wither skeleton either. Okay. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. <laughs> Holy gunpowder. Okay. Gladly take all the gunpowder. Oh. My goodness. Ow! Holy crap. Oh no, we have no more torches. Torches! Just grab all this. I have enough coal, but I don't have any wood with me, so that's why I can't make any torches. And there's not any uh, wood down here either. This might be a pretty long episode. As per usual, my videos are like an hour long. So I do apologize that the videos are super long. I'm just like, hey, they might think it's entertaining. Okay. Let's just keep going. Let's go down this way. I don't like that there's not any torches. Okay. Anything good in here? Take the mushrooms, because we can always use those. And the candles, of course. Ooh, a common loot bag? Nah. What else is in here? Candles! It's so dark! Be nice, little spider. Be nice. I said, be nice to be. Please. Get rid of that. Okay. Anything in here? Ooh, mending. What can I get rid of? What can I get rid of? String. Put all this in here. Not that, because I'm going to need that. We might actually get out here with a lot of gunpowder. Which is good, because we definitely need it for all these rockets. And then we have no more freaking torches. Not good. Not good good so I do apologize that it's dark guys I don't really want the lapis but I'll take the paper and the emeralds and then I'll take the emeralds ow Definitely don't want the copper axe, but I'll take the candle. What about in here? One apple, so I'll take those. Emeralds, I'll take. 
Diamond, of course I'll take. Oh, and the candles. Quickly, let's heal. I don't think there's anything this way. Nope, all clear. Alright, final little fight. Perfect. Alright. Let's get everything out of here. All the ores. Take all of this copper, iron, everything. I do apologize that it's dark, guys. I wish I would. I didn't think I was going to use this many torches down here. I thought a stack would be enough. So I do apologize. And then let me just clear out. I don't need that. I don't need that. I don't need these. Okay. Take these with me. Can't forget the anvil. Decapitator, vein miner. Ooh, frost walk. Why can I not hit the baby? That's fine. And I've already got half of that. Okay. Ooh, thank goodness I checked in here before we left. Because I was just going to say, looks like we got it all. And then leave. But glad I'm checked. Alright, I think we've completed it all. Yeah. Looks like it. And then... Oh. Can't forget those. Did I forget anything in this room? Oh, I did. And I left an emerald. Can't forget the candles and the golden apples. Now, which way is out of here? Already went that way. Oh my gosh, this is like a maze. How am I going to get out of here? Oh, thank goodness I checked in here too. Okay, no gunpowder in there. Let's go this way. And then, yep, we made it back. Alright. Got some pretty good loot, actually. Now that I'm sitting here looking at it, got some pretty good stuff. And then, can anything fit in here? Are both of these backpacks full? They are not. I definitely need those. And then, since we are finished with that, we are going to put these away. And I can finally have my inventory back. Alrighty, guys. So, I am actually going to end this episode here. I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video with going exploring, building all these bridges, and then going through the catacombs. So, oh, and finding off the flinder. Flender, I think that's what the name is. So, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, please make sure to like that video and subscribe if you guys do enjoy and i hope you guys i hope to see you guys in the next one bye y'all there's freaking more of these are you kidding me